mundane man here again and it's such a beautiful day on this Sunday that I decided I have been uh, remiss in not taking out my quad for way too long so I thought today would be a good day to uh, just give a little rip on an easy trail this is called the Iron Horse Trail and one of the staging areas is here at, in uh, Smoky Lake so I'm just gonna go for a little ride for a couple hours and see how it goes Hopefully my quad performs okay, and I put fresh gas in it three months ago, so hopefully that's good enough. But I started it and ran it, and just drove out here and hope for the best. So let's get at it. to come back because I forgot my gloves and it gets a little hard on my hands without them so let's, let's get at her again.
And this is uh, one of the many stops along this trail. And the nice thing about this place is they really support the ATVers along the Iron Horse Trail here. They've got public washrooms, they've got a ramp for uh, loading and unloading and a staging area here, so it's good. And uh, so far trip's been okay. It's hot out today. You don't notice it when you're out on the trail because when you're going 40, 50 kilometers an hour, you don't notice how hot it is until you stop. And it is very hot today. It's probably 27, 28. So I'm going to carry on down the trail a little bit further until uh, my fuel reserve says I got about half and then I'll turn around and come back make sure I got enough fuel to get back. Stopped in the town of Bellas, a little bit of, of a snack, getting hungry. This is going to be one of the quietest towns I've ever been in. The rattling of my bag is probably the noisiest thing around here other than the birds. Incredible. I think I was meant for small town life. that was a good ride. I would say I did about uh, 80 to 90 kilometers return so not even near the full amount of the, uh, the whole trail. Um, fuel kind of stopped me from going any further even though I could have pulled into towns to uh, you know burn off or fill up after I burnt off all the fuel but my intent was to empty it out get rid of this tank and not mix anything new with it so I got back with about uh, a quarter or an eighth of a tank which is good so I don't have uh, any old fuel left in there and that's great. So I think I'm just going to get a little drone shot of the town of Smoky Lake and we'll call her a day.
forgot to mention is I burnt my arms. I'm gonna feel it tonight and the boss lady is gonna tell me something about it too. Something to the effect of, why didn't you wear sunscreen? Well, I forgot. And the other thing too is, uh, I guess uh, street bikers really know this, but when bumblebees hit you in the chest, even when you're wearing a shirt, owie kabibble, that hurts. So anyways, I'm heading home and that's it for this edition of Mundane Man and we'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.